Uh, hi, I'm Zach. I'm Jack. And today we like to talk to you the conversation of the motivations. So, what do you think the motivation of the professional footballer? <laughs> In my opinion, uh, professional footballers have instructive uh, motivation. Uh, can you explain this point clear? Um, yes. Uh, for example, um, mm -hmm. almost football players in China, and they practice the football um, between uh, of between two years to mm -hmm. twelve years, and uh, they began the uh, as I mean five years old. So they have made uh, they have large enthusiasm in the football. Okay. Um. I understand what you are saying, but uh, I want to say that um, most footballers practice because they want to be strong when they were twenty, when they are twenty or thirty to thirty years old, uh, because uh, they can run fast, they can play football well, and I think they just want to earn a lot of money because it is they can earn a lot of money from the football play. So, uh, yes. I, so I, I, I think uh, the footballers uh, pay attention more, pay um, more pay attention to the uh, extrinsic motivation. Yes, I. Uh, but I, um, I, I'm afraid I can't uh, agree with you because, um, may, uh, be a, a professional football footballer. Um, not only about the you can get strong health, strong body, but also you can um, experience the teamwork and mm -hmm. uh, and the, the spirit of the uh, f football and uh, many of things. Yeah, okay. So you talk something about inside. Yes. Uh, so uh, I think that's a good point uh, to sum up. I think um, footballer has both intrinsic and the extrinsic motivation. Uh, so uh, that's all. Thanks. Thanks.